a chaotic scene unfolding. I came to pick up my daughter from the bus stop and I saw helicopters going around. Police tape surrounding the Spring Manor apartment. Next thing I heard was a pop and then a pop, 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 pop. After officers tell us an armed man was gunned down moments after shooting his neighbor in front of the victim's family. I'm tore apart. I'm not doing good at all. My granddaughter seen all this. My son, I don't, you know, it's, these apartments have gotten so bad. I saw him on the ground. I saw his fiance attempting to give him CPR. And when the police arrived. And he was waiting for them because he had more than enough time to try to run away before they arrived. Officers were then confronted by the man with the gun. After several attempts to get the man to drop his gun using commands and less lethal force options, the suspect ran at officers and pointed his gun at them. That's when the police say multiple officers opened fire. The suspect rushed to University Hospital where he died while the victim was taken there in critical condition. Police remaining on scene for hours as those who knew the alleged shooter are shocked by this tragic incident. Because they've never had any sort of altercations. While hoping their loved one pulls through. I don't want to accept it, but if that's what it comes to, then we'll just have to do our best to band together and support each other. Now the chief says LMPD will provide an update with body camera footage tomorrow afternoon. But for now, reporting live in Oklahoma, I'm Trey Ward, WLKY News.